Memphis, Tennessee, the most dangerous city in the U.S. Memphis, in Tennessee, located in the southwestern corner of the state, is full of heart and soul as well as a plethora of cultural and historical treasures. It is a fantastic city with many attractions and strong music, art, and cuisine culture. Although it has attempted to shed its other reputation as a deadly city, it has failed to do so. If you are contemplating a trip to Memphis, watch this video more than once to determine why it is the most dangerous city in the United States. We dug deep into the data and crime reports and talked to inhabitants of the city to give you a more accurate picture of how safe the city is. Memphis Crime Stats First and foremost, we need to tell or remind you how we arrived at our conclusion. The violent crime rate is determined by dividing the number of recorded offenses by the entire population. The result is then multiplied by 100,000 to get the overall rate per 100,000. Memphis is not a safe location to go to or live in. According to statistics, it routinely rates among the most hazardous cities in the United States. The FBI crime data reported in 2019 that Memphis has the fourth highest rate of violent crime with 2,003.32 crimes per 100,000 population. It also has the third highest rate of property crime in the country with 6,297.83 per 100,000 population. The nationwide rate of violent crime is 366.7 per 100,000 inhabitants, while the rate of property crime is 2,109.9 .9 per 100,000 persons, according to FBI statistics. However, the rate is more than three times higher in Memphis than the national average. The crime rates in Memphis are comparable to the worst crimes in Tennessee, St. Louis, Nashville, Detroit, Baltimore, and Milwaukee. Homicides, rapes, robberies, and aggravated assaults are examples of such violent crimes often witnessed in this city at high rates. All of this makes Memphis the most dangerous city in the U.S. Memphis Murder Stats in 2020, 334 killings were reported in Memphis, representing a stunning 74.8% increase over the previous year's total of 191. The killings registered in Memphis are the highest number of homicides ever recorded in the city, breaking the previous 228 homicides record set in 2016. Memphis had a murder rate of 52.44 per 100,000 population in 2020, confirming that it is one of the most violent cities in the U.S. It shares this description with cities such as St. Louis and Baltimore, which are also sources of worry. On an encouraging note, while Memphis witnessed a record number of killings in 2020, most other crime indicators, such as robbery, assault, burglary, and theft, dropped. Is Downtown Memphis Safe? During the day, Downtown Memphis is a pretty secure location to be while visiting. Police are well represented and the presence of the Blue Suede Brigade provides additional protection and assurance of safety. The situation may change late at night when there are fewer people around. Although you may see homeless individuals and aggressive panhandlers when touring downtown, they are mostly harmless and pose no threats to visitors. We advise that you stay in the major sections of downtown and avoid venturing outside of that region since it may get dangerous outside of those areas. Is Memphis safe at night? When it comes to nighttime, safety concerns are usually higher, even in otherwise safe places. Criminals usually get emboldened by darkness. The situation in Memphis can't be an exception. It's especially important for visitors unfamiliar with the city's layout to be cautious. After knowing which neighborhoods and areas to avoid at night, it may be much safer to visit the safer areas early in the evening and return to your shelter before late in the night. Is it safe to travel alone in this location? Visiting Memphis on your own may be a safe experience, provided you know the city's geography and places to avoid. As a single traveler, you should take extra precautions since you are more likely to become a victim of crime. Safest Neighborhoods in Memphis The following are the safest neighborhoods in Memphis. East Memphis Downtown Midtown Harbortown Bartlett Cordova Collierville Germantown Cooper Young Overton Square Crosstown Highland Strip
Of course, some elements of danger exist in these neighborhoods, but it's still relatively safe to be there. Tips for being safe when visiting Memphis Don't go walking around in an unfamiliar location. Keep to the popular or touristy areas of the city. This is especially true at night. Don't come across as a tourist. Confidence in where you're going and what you're doing is essential. Act as though you know where you are and avoid appearing disoriented or out of place. When you park your automobile, make sure nothing attractive or valuable can be seen through the windows. Many have had their cars broken into because they left a few cents in the cup holder or had some books in the back seat. If you're wandering about the city, research and plan your route ahead of time to ensure that you don't end up in an area of the city where you shouldn't be. Don't get lost in Memphis. The city's security is inconsistent and may shift from quite secure to extremely questionable in the blink of an eye. Maintain constant awareness of your surroundings. Understand who is in your immediate vicinity and what is happening around you. When you're out in public, you have to be extra vigilant. Keep your chin up and your shoulders back. Maintaining a constant state of alertness and awareness of your surroundings is essential. Don't spend too much time on the phone to lose track of your surroundings. Know where you're going and when you're going there. Some parts of the city are safe to visit during the day but not at night. Stopping at gas stations with many people lingering outside is not a good idea. If it appears that you shouldn't be there, leave immediately. Is Memphis safe to visit? According to the facts from statistics from the safety perceptions of the residents in the city, Memphis is not a safe location to visit. The rates of violent crime and property crime in the city are among the highest in the country. As a result, many of the locals do not feel secure in their hometown. The problem with Memphis is that the city is fairly blocked by blocks, which means that one street may be pleasant while the next street may be very unsafe. If you are unfamiliar with the city's geography, it is easy to find yourself in one of these dangerous districts. When visiting Memphis, we recommend that you discover exactly which sections of the city are safe and which are not before you go there. Following the safety guidelines outlined in this video can also assist in reducing your chances of being a victim. Try your best not to visit this most dangerous city in the US if you don't have to. If you think we've been unfair to the city in Tennessee, please let us know. We may have also been too lenient or positive in this description. Kindly volunteer your comments for our consideration. Thank you for watching this video. Please don't forget to subscribe, comment, and turn on the notification bell.